Some Mississippi State students have put their education in gear as they work to re-engineer a Saturn view. The task is part of the International Eco Car Challenge, which asks teams to improve the vehicle's fuel efficiency and lower emissions. The Bulldog team will implement a plug-in range-extending vehicle architecture. This will give the car an all-electric driving range of 40 miles and over 100 miles per gallon fuel economy. 77% of Americans travel 40 miles or less round trip to work every day, so this number was kind of a, a goal for us, is uh, to have a 40 mile all-electric range. So you would never turn the vehicle's engine on uh, ever unless you traveled outside of that 40 mile range, which you could definitely see the benefits in uh, fuel cost. The team spent the last year creating computerized vehicle models and simulations for the first phase of the challenge, which concluded at a competition in Canada. Out of 17 competitively selected teams, Mississippi State took third place overall and earned recognition in numerous subcategories. The students also went outside the minimum competition standards to create a realistic driving simulator to wow the judges. We wanted to try to maintain just a little bit of an edge over everybody else. Uh, there were a couple other driving simulators there, which was surprising, but nobody took the time that we did in getting an actual Saturn view. For the second year of competition, headline sponsors General Motors and the Department of Energy provided a Saturn view for each team. With the help of additional local sponsors, the team can start acquiring the necessary tools and parts to implement its design by June year ending two-part competition in Arizona and California. Yeah, we've got a pretty tight timeline. Everything pretty much has to fall into place. Uh, we want to try, we want to have a running vehicle on front and rear axles by December. The spring semester is uh, going to be controls refinement. We're going to make sure that when the driver presses the accelerator pedal, it goes forward and not backwards. We, we just want to make sure that everything uh, blends right. We don't, we don't want the consumer to know that they're driving a hybrid vehicle. We want them to think that it's still just a regular vehicle. More information about the MSU EcoCar team can be found on its website. From the Bagley College of Engineering at Mississippi State University, I'm Diane Godwin.